even the Yi Kam Kun Kut, you say, the, first, the, the, the fifth stanza, he said, Union in the Tan Tian. Is that true that everybody practice uh, union, their, their, their mind and everything in the Tan Tian, get the Qi deal of that? No. Absolutely no. Be careful here. When you put intention to your Tan Tian, a lower abdomen, try to develop Qi there, that is only good for the people who have young deficiency. Remember the filament? When it's short, you pull it high. That's what it is. If it is a yin deficiency, okay, you do that, it's going to cause you to burn more energy in your body and cause your oil is going to burn more. So, that statement in the Xiu Tao, uh, uh, statement 5, the, the stanza 5, is applied only for the healthy people and the young deficiency people. The yin deficiency people, such as uh, people usually have a uh, high blood pressure and so forth, so forth, should not do that. Okay? So, the yin deficiency usually is uh, related to the not enough of blood or inadequacy of, uh, of what of, uh, of the body fluid those kind of stuff okay so there's Chinese medicine okay so you don't practice uh, 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 pay attention to your your dantian all the all, all day long you don't you have to know what type of body it is okay in ancient time when people practice internal art they have a general and a particular. General means the thing which is a general people, everybody can practice. Particular means that you need to know the particular state, the particular person's states of, a, of, a, of, a, of, a, of, a, of health and uh, to, to prescribe that. So a guy who is in the, uh, for example, a guy who is in the young deficiency, they can, they can, uh, focus on their Tantian, their low abs. The guy with the yin deficiency, they have to focus where? In the K1 point under their leg. I tell you this, just tell you the difference. But I don't want you to use it. You need to have somebody who know what he's doing to, 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 to train this kind of stuff. Otherwise, you are, you are doing a, a, a disservice for yourself pulling the reverse gear. Okay? Instead of getting healthy, you get 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 uh, not healthy. Instead of getting balanced, you get imbalanced, right? So, example, you pay attention to your tantian. For a person who is a uh, having deficiency, they already the the oil is already inadequate. You keeping pulling the filament, yeah, I know it's the 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 light getting stronger and stronger. But it's burning the thing out. You know, at, at that, that when we see the light is going stronger, you say, oh yeah, that's good, that's good. What you don't know is under there is burning the oil out. It might get into the, uh, in, in the, in the situations that it becomes yin and yang, both deficient. And now what? Now it's destruction. Okay? So, so, people talk about Zan Zhong. Oh yeah, I want to pay full attention there. I want to divert energy and my energy going up to the spine. You're crazy. If you know the real deal, you don't play around with this thing. Okay? And uh, I like to be saying this seriously. Because uh, you don't mess around with this thing. What if the guy have a high blood pressure or something like that? Or, or different, different issue, diabetics or anything, and you cause him more problem? That's responsibility. Okay. So this is not about religion. This is technology. This is linked to the Chinese medicines. This is not for fun. And even for the guy who have kidney deficiency and so forth, you 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 you, you have heat on your dantian. You think that's good? No. It causes problem. And somebody who say, oh yeah, I don't have I I need some sex power and I doing those kind of stuff. They end up damage the thing, and they just stimulate the whole thing and uh, get the whole whole body excited, but it, it drain energy. 
that is not qigong. That is not a proper practice of qigong. Pra proper practice of qigong is to balance, and then you grow. Okay. To balance the body, to uh, uh, take out the stagnations, and then you let it grow stronger and stronger. That's qigong. Okay. And then and then after a while you don't manipulate it anymore. Just let it be. That is the return to the Tao, to start stop doing advanced level. Okay? So you want to talk about health, you want to go talk about Qigong, you want to talk martial art, this is the basic. If you don't know this basic, don't touch it. Okay? There's nothing to, for us to, 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 to play clever about. Okay? Now, another thing I want to talk about is this. You want to lead Qi? Leading Qi, one need to know how this channel works, how they link together. The, the hand tree yin, hand tree yang, the, 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 the run and the, the do, and then the eight special, special channel, how they works. Need to be knowing how they works properly. And when you lead it to, to, to take away stagnation, think about like the doctor give acupuncture, try to balance the body, they have to know what happened, which point to hit in. It's not just a random thing, okay? So, so one need to know all these things, have these basics in order to do the, uh, the, 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 the this type of uh, the what they call it, the balancing and the the stagna stagnations uh, removing, okay? One just don't simply go do it uh, the way they want or, or interpret. Uh, it's not up for any anybody's interpretation. These channels, for thousands of years, people know it is there, that it is a, f a physical phen uh, phenomenon. It is there. Okay? And it causes um, biochemical effect. Okay? So this is real stuff. Okay? You don't mess around with this thing. And uh, another thing too. If the body, if the mind, the intention is not well handled or well developed, what if when they, when they, when they lead the chi into a certain channel and they get stuck, and the chi stuck there because of the intention is too strong or the intention is too weak or the intention suddenly gets scattered, now you get a problem. So you can hear a lot of people who have what they call the qigong sickness or we call it tian cha. It's when they lead the qi uh, first in the improper channel. They don't know how this thing link together. The second thing is that they lead it to certain place. One of the very normal issue is that people try to practice the, the, the small cosmic cycle. The qi, they lead the qi using their intention and so forth, the strong intention up to the head. And the chi shoot to the head. Now, they do not know how to get it down. So it becomes dizzy. Okay? And then cause a whole bunch of issues. So, and uh, particularly when the hybrid pressure people is not supposed to practice this, uh, this, uh, this uh, small cosmic cycle. The hybrid pressure people are not supposed to practice that. Because they have a tendency of when you go up there, it's stuck in the head, cannot get going down. Now it can cause even more trouble for the for for the for, for the uh, high blood pressure people, okay. So all this small cosmic cycle and all this this is not a marketing deal. This is a, a, a medicine. It's a medicine which is which is a, a need to 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 prescribe by doctor to a, a certain people. Okay, it is not like oh yeah, I, I just get a cosmic cycle and everything will be great. No. If you do it the wrong way, you end up imbalancing it, get it even more stuck. And who's going to help you? Okay? I put this, sorry, I put this in a very serious form as well, because this is dealing with the real thing. We, we, you know, the bottom line, all my, my, my Sifu taught me is this, if you cannot help people, don't screw them up. Ask them to go to, 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 to get some uh, better doctor. Okay? It is not about ego or fame or anything. If you cannot help them, 
ask them to you know help them to get a doctor tell them you don't know don't go in all around and then mess everything up okay playing 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 a uh, guru okay okay another thing in qigong which is uh, very important is deep breathing lower abs breathing and the upper lower abs breathing usually is a, is is really fine very soft breathing it's going to penetrate down it's due to the body is relaxed so the repetitions per minutes going down uh, repetition breathing uh, breathing repetition per minute going down and so on and uh, that there's a few a, a different advantage one is of course uh, they, they increase the, the breathing volume you know, for the circulation for the oxygen so forth and second is massaging the internal organs okay uh, in, uh, in martial arts, a lot of these things happen because they want to strengthen their internal organs, right? And, and then they build up Qi too, okay? So that is the, 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 uh, the, the, uh, the importance of the lower abs breathing in the Qigong practice, which is, you know, but it needs to be nature, right? It's a basic need for nature. As for the mind, the mind needs to be quiet down. If the mind is not quiet down, then it's stress, and then it creates a whole bunch of different stuff. Okay? The body is not loose, then every everything is gone. If the body is not loose, then your mind will not be quiet. It's kind of unsettled, and then the breathing will not be be, be na nature. Okay. Uh, another thing I want to talk about is the heat sensation. People sometimes say, "Oh yeah, I have heat already. I practice qigong, I have heat." You're crazy. If you say that, first heat is not an indicator of you have chi or not. Why? Because over intention, the intention too strong intention create heat in the body. Too uh, over breathing create heat too. Stress can create those stuff stuff too. Sensations. Okay, now we talk about young, uh, young deficient and indeficient. This heat in the qigong is referred as rise the fire, start the fire, right? Raise the fire. If you are young deficient, it probably can help you a little bit. If it pro provided it is not a not an over stress, over intention type of deal. Over stress, over intention is just like a what? Like uh, you're cooking boiling water, you put too much water there, uh, 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 fire there, firewood there, and the whole thing will boil up, and then you can break the the pot. That is the uh, that that is a uh, over over overheat. Okay, so breathing heavy, too heavy a breathing or too heavy intention cause those kind of effect. So so even the guy who practice uh, with the as we we talk about. Uh, the young deficient people they can practice and uh, pay attention to the dantian to have the to rise the the, the, the heat up or the, the, the start the fire even them have to watch out if the breathing or the, the intention is too strong they end up burning chi okay it's called strong fire burn away chi or strong fire heat chi even in the young intention uh, deficient people will cause that issue now if you have a, if one have a yin deficiency and it already 